Welcome back. So if you're a member of the closed Facebook group, you will have already seen some of this, but I wanted to show you a close-up picture of the Work in Progress 1989 Batwing. These are the early production samples, so this is exactly the detail you can expect, but the detailing of the paint and decals on the interior of the cockpit are still yet to be done, so you don't see that. I lost my real DX-09 uh, Hot Toys in uh, the American show that we did with the prototype, so to show you that the Batman 12-inch figure still fits in there, we got an, uh, a generic one just to show you there's more room between the targeting glasses and the and the head, and so as you can see, there's plenty of room even for a much larger figure with the higher ears. And as you can see, the targeting computer has been redesigned with the correct round glasses. Now, people have also been wondering about the assembly, so we've done a quick assembly video for you here. So basically, people were wondering and worrying about the wings and if they would ever sag. So with, with my two assistants, we're, we're doing an assembly of the final version. So this is a, a full metal rod that goes uh, through the, embody, the body entirely. And then there are metal pins or there are pins on the wings that help line up and so that they don't torque or, or twist when that once once everything is seated and as you can see especially with that full metal bar in there this will uh, will never sag and finally it's also going to be a lot easier to wall mount this or put it on a stand by first mounting the body using the supplied metal tripod feed with holes that you can see now and then it's just a matter of plugging in these two plugs to connect the wires of the front lights on the wings then this just snaps into place you can also see the metal legs by the way that uh, hold up and can also be used as i just mentioned to mount it to a wall or ceiling or what or, or whatever stand you have so details and decals are still to be added to this uh, and once that is done i will show you the exact final version but this is pretty close to what you will be getting so just to clarify on the screen now, you're seeing a rendering with the rendering of the decals. Those will be weathered, and of course the paint, as you have seen, is more weathered. So thanks for watching, and until next time.